Hello friends, welcome to Keyframes Online. My name is Abhishek Inamdar. I am a technical director in Keyframes Animation Academy, Pune. Today I will show you how to make a chair, office chair, uh, right from modeling, texturing and lighting. Uh, basically, uh, today we'll see how to make a chair, office chair with the help of splines. Basically, your main thing will be splines. So, let's get started. I'll take rectangle in top viewport. Something like this. I'll go to modify, right click, convert to editable spline. I'm selecting a segment and there's a command called divide. Basically divide command is also in AutoCAD where we basically divide a segment into the parts. Same command is in 3D Max. So I'll make two and say divide. I'll say select, divide, select, divide, select, divide. I want two vertices on uh, each segments so I'll go in left viewport modify I'll go in vertex mode now I'll select all the vertices see if you see the bezier these are the bezier's but I don't want the bezier's so right click say corner so there will be a no bezier's I'm selecting like this and getting something like this and this point will be like this yeah or you can say you can match like this Fine, no problem. I'll say modify. I'll say in perspective. This will look something like this. I'll scale it down. Go in rendering, enable render, enable in viewport. You can add thickness from here. Select vertices. This one, this corner vertices for fillet. And I say fillet. like this go in front viewport I'll take a line line uh, Sorry, I'll, I'll go in left viewport and I'll take L shape rectangle, L shape line. Modify. This is 
just I'll check it's too sharp like in the radial No problem. Just adjust it. I'll go in top viewport. Press shift track. Front viewport. Take circle. Modify off report and render I want radius convert to a little spline select vertices this should be breaked I'll go and say break then this vertices will be here this vertices like this see this vertices is not base is not moving right click I'll say axis constraint XY now this can be moved like this and can be kept like this straight this be like this And same will do in mirror. Make a mirror, copy, what I says. Say attach, attach, select both the vertices, say fuse first, it will come closer and then weld. And then select a spline, then say outline, then say extrude. Slightly, we have to add this because it will look nice when it is closer. This And this corner will be what I assist. Select this one. Slightly you can give the fillet 1.68 this will I will make a duplicate copy of it cancel it and say angle snap toggle and percentage so it will give perfect 90 degree
come in front I take a spear go in perspective move it say scale radius something like this maybe slightly yes this will be a great select duplicate copy spear same thing we can duplicate I'll give the support to the chair take spline I'll off this one. Now I'll select vertices. Select corner vertices. First I'll make like this place over here. Then I'll go to vertices to give a fillet. it spline outline stun or else we can short this one if it looks odd like this will be great I'll make a copy of it this I'll give come to front viewport I'll take arc this to this modify I'll say all enable support to the go to display hierarchy sorry I'll affect pivot point center to object that's it this will be a support first here somewhat I'll reduce the size of the support it will be SS material stainless steel material So this is what we got. Slightly there is a problem somewhat. There should be support like this. Like this. So I'll select.
and move like this. Now I'll make give another support over here. Take a line. like this so this is the modeling part in next part we will will give material slightings and do the rendering part so we'll see you in second part if you like my tutorial do subscribe my channel that is keyframes online if you want any kind of tutorial in 3d max or in photoshop or in after effects or in premiere whichever software you want just tell me let me know in comment box on my keyframes online channel i'll do that tutorial for you so we'll meet in next tutorial have a great day